The universe consists of a few key elements. Carbon is one and is fundamental to life. We used to think it existed only in two forms, extremely hard, diamond, the other, extremely soft, graphite. Then, in 1985, a scientist named Harold Croto was looking into space for a molecule called HC7N. As he and his colleagues were trying to recreate HC7N inside the lab, they discovered something amazing. A pure carbon molecule made up of 60 carbon atoms and nothing else. It was shaped like the geodesic sphere an architect named R. Buckminster Fuller designed 40 years prior. So Croto's team named the molecule Buckminster Fullerene, commonly known as Buckyball. Croto's discovery won him and his team the Nobel Prize and led to the science of fullerenes, which has applications such as solar cells, nanocircuits, drug delivery systems, and carbon nanotubes. Sir Harold's journey proved that sometimes looking out into the universe can open our eyes to worlds right in front of us.